Welcome back. CNBC reporting Google is planning to launch its own foldable smartphone this June, making a big investment in the product while cost cutting still remains a priority elsewhere. That's the focus of today's Tech Check segment with our Deirdre Bosa. So what do we know about this, Deirdre? So our Jen Elias on the digital side got a hold of internal documents and photos revealing that Google is planning to launch a foldable Pixel smartphone that will cost upwards of $1,700 and in doing so directly challenge Samsung's dominant position in this foldable space. Kind of, though. Google's smartphone business, it is a mere blip on the global market share chart here. It has about 2% of North America. When you go global, it doesn't even register. Apple and Samsung are the clear leaders, which raises the question, why is Google still pouring money into this business when its big tech peers are scaling back on money losing businesses and focusing on costs and efficiency? Amazon, for example, hasn't refreshed its flagship Echo device in years and has made cuts to its devices unit, which is losing billions annually. Google, though, is going in the other direction, doubling down on Pixel phones. CFO Ruth Porat on the last earnings call, she said, we continue to make sizable investments, particularly to support innovation across our Pixel family. The answer, though, may not lie in the smartphone race, but a layer down in operating systems and Android's strategic position in the Google ecosystem. Pixel smartphones, they may be a blip. They are a blip, barely. But Android, it dominates. It makes up more than 70 percent of global mobile operating systems. It is the OS of choice for basically any phone that is not an iPhone. It has this giant presence with even without actual Google hardware. And Google is still above all else a search company, guys. Having its search engine integrated into all and Android devices is all about protecting that moat and one of the best business models in history. One, by the way, that as we've talked about is starting to show cracks in the face of Microsoft and ChatGPT. And the report this week that Samsung, one of the biggest Android users on its smartphones, was considering replacing Google search with Bing on its smartphones. So taking all of that into consideration, a flashy new foldable Pixel phone may not be so much about the phone, but it does signal that Google isn't going to sit back here.